wanted to film outside but uh, it's so windy I can't even talk <laughs> so we are in a Georgian village uh, not far from the mountains and we are going to get some groceries because uh, we'll have a little celebration tomorrow with uh, the neighbors like local Georgian celebration I wanted to show you where we get our groceries uh, usually because places look quite interesting <laughs> here there is one supermarket that probably will go to two but most of the stores are very small let's go get some veggies first because we need a lot of them <laughs> kind to let me film in their little store and they also help us to put our bags in the in the car I'm so shy when I have to film and there are people around because in the supermarket in Russia where I was filming it was a huge supermarket and uh, I didn't bother anybody and here the little stores and the owners are like where I do want to film but <laughs> anyway they were kind and let me film a little bit and now we're going to our next destination which is uh, cheese and chicken we need to find some cheese and chicken so let's go <laughs> We got chicken, cheese, uh, sour cream, and uh, bread. The bread smells so good. You just, you just want to eat it right here. <laughs> it's very good. I couldn't film much in the store with chickens, but these are chickens from small farms. And now we are going to get other type of meat. We need pork and we need beef 
for barbecue tomorrow and then we'll probably go to the local small supermarket uh, to get some other stuff I don't I don't really know if we need something else but we'll see these little stores if you can call them stores because they always have the best quality of food uh, the best like veggies and the best meat much better than in big supermarkets because everything is fresh and just good quality so I really like them they might not look perfect <laughs> but they have very nice food I can tell you the beef here is such a good quality because literally these cows walk around these villages just on the fields just around the village on the road everywhere around you just drive and there are a lot of cows everywhere and sometimes it seems like nobody actually looks after them because sometimes they're just walking by themselves <laughs> so people let them walk and they walk around and eat the grass and I think it's so good for their health probably because the beef here, it's, it tastes so good. Like literally, it's the best beef I've ever eaten in my life. The final uh, store now and then we'll go home and I'll show you everything we bought. <laughs> we came to the supermarket, the toilet is just eating the bread. <laughs> we can't go inside. <laughs> one thing in Georgian uh, stores that is weird to me uh, you can't film in stores I think they have a law or something like that so like it's prohibited to film in stores especially the normal ones like supermarkets uh, malls and similar stores like that so I was trying my best uh, to film but I couldn't film much because there were a lot of people in the store but still anyway it's just a regular supermarket it's I think similar worldwide it's just supermarket with a lot of uh, goods So the first 
place we got our groceries was the store with vegetables and fruits and I don't remember how much exactly how many kilograms everything was uh, so I put everything here on the table so you can see approximately how many like fruits and vegetables we got and I think in total uh, all of that was uh, about 50 lari which is approximately 17 US dollars when I say dollars in my videos, it's always US dollars because it's just easy to compare everything with US dollars. So about $17, everything in total. And let me show you what we have here. So we have cucumbers, tomatoes, uh, eggplants, a lot of greens, garlic, uh, spicy peppers. Um, this is like zucchinis, uh, onions, peppers, a lot of diff two kinds of peppers, apples, uh, these are like peaches, melon, potatoes, and bananas. I was laying down other things on the table and I noticed that Tolly and Agatha ate half of the bread already. <laughs> and it's so funny, but this bread is the tastiest when you just buy it because it's freshly made and it's still warm when you buy it. So we always eat almost half of it right <laughs> when we buy it. So that's, that's okay. <laughs> but it was just funny because I wanted to film and there's just almost no bread anymore. <laughs> so this is what we got in the next little store. This is sour cream, two big things of sour cream. This is about a dollar and a half each. So almost five flurry. This is cheese, Soluguni, Georgian cheese. I have no idea how much this cost. And this is farmer's chicken. It was about 10 lari, which is about three and a half dollars for a kilogram. The chicken is, I don't know, maybe two, three kilograms. So in total, all of that was almost 70 lari, which is a little bit less than $25 for the chicken, cheese and sour cream. Here is our meat that uh, the man cut specifically for our needs for all the meals that we need. So here are two kilograms of beef, which was about 15 US dollars. And uh, here are five kilograms of pork, which was about 27 uh, US dollars. But that's including uh, the bone, the fat and the skin too, which he cut off and we saved it for our dogs. So we'll use it anyway, but that's including the price. So the total amount of meat itself is a little bit less. Not very much, but a little bit less. The bread itself, it was like that, uh, was less than a dollar. And here is everything we got in the supermarket. So it's milk, walnuts, eggs, and this is, oops, uh, this is cooking cream, it's called. So this is, this is a cream for, for cooking. It's the same, but just different brand. That's actually a Russian one. That's funny. So in total, uh, all of that was about 15, 16 US dollars. I don't remember at all how much each thing cost. So I'm sorry. So the total cost of everything turns out to be 279 lari, which is almost $100, it's like 99 something. And that's a big amount of food actually, especially meat, but we have guests over tomorrow, so we needed more meat and chicken for tomorrow and just more vegetables. Um, I don't think we would eat all of that ourselves, especially like pork and beef. <laughs> but Georgians love meat and everything made with beef and pork, so we got a little bit more of that and we didn't buy things like pasta or rice or beans because we have them at home so we just bought what we needed today and write down guys where you're from and if your groceries in your place cost more or less let's talk about that in the comments let's discuss this thing a little bit and thank you for watching hope to see you in the next video bye bye My children doesn't want me to film my videos. <laughs>